All right, I got the briefcase. Now what? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know the place. Let me get this straight. You want us to leave it in the dumpster and then drive away? Oh, whatever you say, boss. Consider it done. What did he say? He said we're supposed to leave it in the dumpster behind that grocery store on 53rd. And then? And then somebody will be by to pick it up. Let's get to it. Please, I'm begging you. I wish there was something I could do. Please, mister, I ain't eaten in three days and we're hungry. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I just can't be handing out food to everyone who asks for it. You understand. But my son is ill, and if he doesn't... Ma'am, I'm sorry. If I could do something, I would, but my hands are tied. Now, you'll have to excuse me. Hey, 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 what are you doing? Taking a little peek. Put it back. Hey, just because I'm the new guy does not mean I don't deserve to see what I'm risking my neck over. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What if the case is rigged to explode when you open it? Then what, Jimmy? I didn't think of that. Well, you better start thinking about that type of thing if you want to make it in this business. What, like you? Old man Ted, the teacher? <laughs> I'm afraid you'll have to find a new mentor after tonight. Why is that? Oh, what I'm saying is... This is it. It's the end of the line. You're quitting the business? Yes, sir. -y. Why? You've been with it since the beginning. It's just not worth the risk. You know, I got a family to worry about. I can't let anything happen to them. Of all the people I could get stuck with, I'm stuck with Ted the family man. You're not getting soft on me, are you? Hell no. Hard as fuck. Don't you worry. All right. All right. What are you going to do for money, though? I mean, no job pays as good as this one does. Eh, I've been saving up quite a bit over the years in this business. <laughs> I got so much, I don't even know what to do with all of it. You know, if I could just uh, just find some cause or, or something and finally do some good in this world. What's the boss got to say about you quitting? Does he know about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's cool. We go way back. He gave me this job as uh, a last hurrah. It should be no problem if we stick to protocol. Yeah. I'm just gonna put this back then. Yeah. All right, here we are. Have at it. Me? Why do I always gotta make the drop? Because I'm older than you and I'm the one driving. You aren't going soft on me, are ya? This is bullshit. Hey, I'll keep a lookout. Clear. So now what? Now we're done. That's it? We're not gonna find out who picks up the briefcase? The boss said to leave the case and drive away, and that's exactly what I intend to do. But what if they're not the ones who find it? What if someone else... Relax. The boss knows what he's doing. We did our part. 
You weren't kidding. The boss really did give you an easy last job. Well, it was nice working with you, kid. No, no, this is it for me. Yeah, as soon as I get these out, I'm going home. Night, Greg. Is everything all right, miss? It's my baby. He's not breathing. All right. All right. Don't panic. Um, he needs a doctor. Right. Listen, I will go inside and I'll call an ambulance. There's no time. We got to get him to a hospital now. Do you have a car? Of course. I'll, I'll be right back. I'll pull around. Hurry! Are you here with the young mother and her child? Yes. Yes, what's the word on the kid? We've stabilized him, but it's only temporary. He has what's known as ventricular septal defect. We need to get him into the OR right away. Well, what are you waiting for? We're talking about heart surgery. It's an expensive procedure, and without any kind of insurance. Oh. I'll be covering all the expenses. That's very kind of you, Mr. Just call me Harry. I'm sure the mother will be pleased, Harry. Listen, just please do what you have to do. And hurry. Yep. What? I don't know. What do you mean they never got it? We did exactly what you said. We left it in the dumpster and drove away. What? You think I would try to pull one over on you? On my last job? With all the years we've known each other. Yeah, fine. Me and Jimmy will uh, we'll head over there first thing in the morning and straighten everything out. What was that all about? Oh, nothing. Just a uh, mix-up at work. I'll take care of it tomorrow. I thought today was your last day. No more jobs, you said. It was, but, uh, but something's happened. But no more after tomorrow. All right, I promise you. You better be right. I worry about you.